Hello and welcome back to Darkwood Alpha 8. I think we already talked to the Wolfman. Yeah, okay, so we just wrapped all this up. But I... I guess I'm a little confused about why I spawned. You know, well... Yeah, let's go ahead and close that, just in case. I remember a few times where there was just random... Ah, never mind. We'll just leave it. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, anyway, if I remember correctly, we were heading to the underground entrance. And also, we should probably explore a little bit. We also have the burned houses to go to, because now we have a plank with nails to defend ourselves with. And we also have at least one torch. Is that... I thought I had a different... Maybe the other torch has more time on it? I don't know, because that, that is not going to be long enough for the underground entrance. So, I need to make sure that I find something that does have enough time on it. Which is not this, apparently. I don't remember where it was that I stashed it. It's been a couple of days since I last played. But it's no longer storage. Nothing in here. Last night was uneventful, I do remember that. I think our... We've got a bunch of wood. No, we made a bunch of wood. And that's why everything is actually pretty hunky-dory in here already. Minus 15, oh wait, sorry. Fuel 10.5, it costs 10, <laughs> I thought it said, I thought that was how much fuel it had. I'm like, uh oh, it has negative fuel. That's bad, that can't be good. Can we craft a torch? Not really. Well, I'm gonna go to the underground entrance anyway and just sort of hope that we find materials on the way there. Hello, oh, it's one of you. At least you're basically harmless until we get too close. I, this is one of those little copses of things that has an entryway somewhere. Is it around here? There it is! Found it! Yes? Mushrooms! I kind of feel like I should go cook them right now since... Hot meat. I will take meat for now. I never use the meat for what it's actually useful for in game normally, which is to distract the animals. Probably should. Just, you know, all things considered. Uh hold on, I'm trying to listen closely. Okay, there's no more mushrooms, so. I think I should have enough time on these. I, th I think did they change the image slightly or has it just been long enough for me to not totally remember what it's supposed to look like? Underground entrance, there we go. We're here already. Down here, I think? Yeah, okay. And if I remember, uh-huh, okay. So we've got we've got some things already. That's good. I hear some mushrooms. Ooh, bear trap! Let's take that. I'm down for scrap. And not walking into it later and hurting myself completely. That also sounds like a good thing. I think there are more of these than I remember. This is the place. I will find the entrance to the underground here. Okay. Well. Is this, is this open? No. And there's a useless door. And a corpse with bandages. That's good. I think that's... Is that new? I don't remember if that had anything. I don't remember much about this game for some reason. This is a door, right? Yeah, I do remember this guy, because it has inflicted so much pain and suffering on me in the past. Nothing here, nothing there, what's in the wardrobe? Ooh, gasoline, that's good. A pack of cigarettes, two filters, two something... I forget what the brand name means, but it's on the wiki now, since someone helpfully pointed it out several videos ago. Alright. I think there's more mushrooms in here. Yes. Not quite there, but close enough. Are these the large ones? They take longer to harvest. No, just normal odd mushrooms. Alright. Do we have enough? I don't have any rags. I'm gonna hope to the underground tunnels. Yes. Oh. Hopefully it hasn't frozen. 
There we go. Okay, just loading. Good. Good. Dim light reveals the wet walls of the underground passage. The rest is covered in complete darkness. I need a light source to continue. Planks! So many planks. Uh. Alright, so I don't have... I know time stopped in here, so I don't need to worry too much. Oh! Did I get a chain trap from un... No, I guess I've just had that in my inventory. I forgot about that too. But we don't have any rags, and we would need rags to do the torch. So I'm just gonna leave. Oh, I don't have to click to exit anymore. I think I think I used to have to do that because I remember a couple of times running away from the chomper in there just to, uh, you know, eventually just hit the like do multiple things showy thing. I don't remember. Well, anyway. So I'm gonna go to the burned houses instead, and hope that I can find more supplies, maybe a rag, or two. Maybe two rags. Ooh, buddy. Ooh, or this. Which, yeah. I think we should at least try it. changed layout wise too. Oh really? There's nothing in this direction. Oh, okay, I was like, was that thunder? Okay, that's fine. I'm okay with thunder. Rain. Rain does make it harder to hear things though. That's the, the worst part. I don't think that goes anywhere. A little path back here? No. But I can see around it, so that's good. Okay, I hear a sleeping one. That's good. Ah. Damn it! I don't remember the path through this maze anymore. Uh, right, it's right here. I don't know why. Okay. Okay. I heard something. Is that it? That's probably it. I'm just gonna search for right here. Don't you worry. Everything is fine. I do want that. I do not need the meat. Well, actually the meat would be really useful here. I don't know think about it. Is there an easy way out? Of course not. If there's an easy way out, there would be an easy way in. So I'm just going to quietly leave now. Quietly leave. Why <laughs> quietly running away leave? Ah, oh, he's such a heavy smoker. I like to think that he's actually a heavy smoker, because he just runs out of... I mean, this is a reasonable frame of time to run out of breath, frankly. But he just starts breathing so heavily <laughs> every time. Alright, especially given that he, he's a good sprinter, though. We just, we just go, and it's fine. Now then, uh, I am a little bit low on space. And I don't know, I like the toolbox. Toolboxes are really useful. And the battery and stuff, too. Uh, we already did that, yes. Hey, doggy. I'll just be over here somewhere. Doing things. Everything is fine. Uh, 
way that the dogs sound louder. It's just the right amount of creepy. Oh, I almost stepped on that. Is it gonna jump me by the back? Oh god, why? Oh, wait. Run, shoot. This one looks stuck. That's fine. Oh god. That looks like... <laughs> yeah, go, shoot. I'm fine with not wasting crap on you that I don't need to waste on you. You know, I'd never really thought about the rain before. Because it has been so infrequent in practice. At least in, in my, you know, time with the dark wood. From time to time it happens, but I was never really doing anything like this. Like something more critical, I guess. Shrooms? Really? Oh, come on. Yeah, I can throw away. I don't need the stones anymore. I say, as I... Like, I'm probably gonna run out of this immediately and... Oh man, that's... that's super flickery. So far... There used to be a thing under you, yes. Oh man. A white dress. A red swing. Those will be important later. Alright, so they stacked six. That's good. That's an, that's an interesting number. I don't know how many nails I have. But I think... Is the, are the matches useful? I can make torches with them. I'm tempted to... Did I make a chain trap? I think I did, and I wanted to use it, so I don't want to toss that out. Toss away the battery, because we don't have a flashlight or anything yet. We'll, we'll get one soon, probably. I don't, I don't actually know. Don't hold me to that. Uh, what the? You don't learn. I spared you all, and yet, nothing. No recognition. I thought there would be more... I feel like I missed something here. I don't know, I just have a vague recollection of there should be more stuff. But I guess, I guess not. It looks like I touched all the things, so... I'm gonna go back now, because this looks pretty sundowny. And I'm not totally sure where it is that I am. Yeah. We really should. What's this? Is this the location? It looks like a tree of some kind. Some specification. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Where are we? No idea. Good. I think it's up here. It sounds about right. It's, I don't want to get too far away from the road, because I know the road's pretty close. Oh, come on. Alright, so we're on the back of the road. Alright, so it's probably just straight up. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, 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 we did it. We did it. Go away. Know your place. I'm going to cook really quick and then turn on the generator. Because I want to... If I can't cook during the night, it's going to... These are all gonna spoil. Ooh, we did enough to fill ourselves. Ah, oh, damn it. <sighs> all right, has any of these changed? Mushroom heating, eating mushrooms restores your health. Navigator, once a day you can drop a part of your body which will serve as a map marker. It can also be used as bait. Once a day you can restore health when standing next to turned on lamps, moth. And farsightedness see further. For right now, this is clear wind. I think. Alrighty. Okay, and now I'm gonna go turn on the generator and then close this out. Uh, damn it. I think I need about that much for one night. Uh, I accidentally hit a key. So he's like, I don't have any skills, what are you talking about? But I do like how they sort of foreshadow it a little bit with that yet. It's like, 
You will one day have skills. Don't worry, friend. I'm gonna go ahead and make some noise and drag this thing now, because I just mm, want better lighting over here. Alright, night time begins. I'm not doing too well health-wise. Let's go ahead and heal. I know we heal in the morning, but I have a number of healing items. We should be okay. Ooh, ooh, I hear them. Uh, we want to keep a few of these things on us so that we can... We don't need this. Can I do any of these yet? No, i got to go find some rope first. I thought I... F hadn't I found some rope? Oh, I did. Oh, I can make this. Great. Yeah. Inventory. Uh, uh, oh. That's the toolbox, right? Oh, no, just straight up. Okay, I'll do that then. Now I need a toolbox. Okay, so I have I have this thing, and now I can craft the inventory upgrade. Excellent. Switch to that to avoid any unfortunate mishaps. I do want to keep these with me, I guess. Uh, these I don't think I really want to keep with me. Bottles. I already don't remember how it is that I like to organize things, but I also don't have a whole lot of stuff in them yet, so it doesn't really matter right now. Alright, I'm gonna go... Uh, oh! I see it. Um, what is that? Oh, hey! It's a thing! I want to go outside. I know it's not that dangerous. At least not in this area. Damn it, chair. Making noise, making me nervous. Is this flickering because it's low on gas? Or because there's something about to happen? Do I need more than one and a half? I thought I only needed one and a half, but maybe that's after... I don't, can I cook that? I think I can cook that. I think that... yeah. Okay. One and a half is not enough. Running blindly in the dark. Okay, so one and a half. I'm just gonna empty this out. just don't want to worry about this anymore. Find out. So that was one and a half plus however much it is. Well, hold on. I didn't fill it up, right? Okay, I have almost two. Boy, am I glad that I screwed up like this on the first few nights. This makes me remind reminds me of when the, this game used to be uh, like <laughs> just up to it. That side is full of chompers right now. And sort of the dominant strategy was just to hide behind a closet the whole night. I'm really glad this game finally, uh, not finally, but that the, uh, the nights became a whole lot more interesting with the events and stuff. I'm really glad they went that route. It, oh, okay. It's daytime-ish. Soon. That's what that means, I guess. Oh, we got our odd night mushroom. That's good. I guess if this is like Alpha 7, this will be the first time we meet the three as well. Let me try and stand inside them. Think they usually spawn about here. They used to. So this is supposed to look like dawn, and it does. Like this kind of looks like dawn, but this is way too red. This looks scary. <laughs> it's so dramatic. I love it. Day three. Can barely tell. Hello. I have missed you and your beautiful faces. The visitors stare at me in silence as if waiting for my move. I can only hear the heavy breathing of the tallest figure who's holding a giant bag. It reeks of mushrooms. 
What does that smell like? It looks like they want to give me something. Good. They will also take this thing. Uh, we can take gas. We can buy ooh, gas tank. Hitting the tank will release gas under high pressure. That's new. Maybe that's new in this alpha. I think so. Uh, we can also get... Right, so this is our usual upgrade loop. Now I remember this. So we could do... Okay. Was it always... I thought there was always a little bit left over. It was like 40. But now it's just... You, you, get, you get what you get. But maybe I'm misremembering. Maybe this was like a savings plan where we would be like, we're going to get gas this time instead. And gas certainly is interesting, but I think... Well... I'm trying to remember because I know the ovens are going to get more efficient. But in this route, we kind of kind of want to get skills quickly right now, I think, maybe. I don't know. I mostly want to craft stuff and do the underground place and then go meet the wolf at the forest and sort of just, you know, make progress. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm just going to get, yeah, I'm just not going to think about it too hard. Because this is kind of the, the most valuable thing to do right now. Ooh, I can extract 25 essence. That's not bad. It doesn't rot either. So I wonder if, is it worth holding onto this until later? 20 essence, wow. It's not bad at all. So this is slightly better than the mushrooms. Well, yeah, then I guess not really, because this is only slightly better than the mushrooms. Forget what happens if you eat it. I don't think it's anything worth doing. I don't want to waste it. That's certainly the way that would most obviously have the most payoff. Let's go find out how much gas we actually need in the typical, typical week then. Typical night, that is. Not week. So that puts it at about... About two, I guess. Because it was about one and a half, and it looks like it ate about a half more. So we don't have we don't have enough for the next night. That's great. Uh, what can we do about it? We could find stuff to trade with the tree, so we can get some gas from them. That could work. I think they like bottles, if I remember correctly. And I don't really do much with the bottles myself because well, the gas bottles are new. Toxic and flammable gas. That sounds really cool, actually. Can we make these already? I don't have the required resources. Okay, so we could. It's not one of the upgrade things we need. Uh, we could start saving towards the upgrades. We can make bear traps. I kind of want to put down this chain trap somewhere, so I think I'll do that first. But as far as I can tell, I don't really have a reason to be dragging around this bottle. Because I don't have anything rotten and I don't have any of these. So I'm just going to stuff that back in here. If I want to make a torch, I do need the matches, so I'm going to keep the matches on hand. And I do need a plank, I think, no matter what. Yeah. And then alcohol and a rag. So the key is to find a rag. Uh, I do want to keep the nail. There we go. This is, this is a more familiar set of things. I'm going to go try to place the chain trap down somewhere. Just so we can, you know, possibly see what it's what it's good for, if anything. There you go. This desk, this is one of the lower things. The light will shine over that. This is probably the most useless place to put it, but I'm just curious about. Man, what's it? That thing looks huge. All right. I hope I don't get caught in it. Everything is all all good. Nothing needs maintenance. I don't think I've heard anything hit anything. Ah, but we, so we are on the hunt for rags, so we can torch, and for gas, so we don't die. Uh, they do like bandages, which is pseudo rags. You can buy rags from you. Kind of cheap. We can get rags. We could trade one of these for rags. I'm tempted. I'm genuinely tempted, because then, let's see, well, this is kind of more important. We can always search for rags later. How much do I need? At least 42. Uh, maybe I should have given them a trap. Maybe that would have been a better idea. I kind of want to 
double done. Well, I'm trying to remember if it's a good idea. I'm going to keep that there for now. I think it works to put them in here, but I'm not totally sure. Anyway, I do have this, which have value 5. And ultimately, the question is how much is the. How much are these worth? Because maybe it's worth making a few of these and selling it to them. Do they sell them? That's the easiest way to find out. They sell these. They will take five. Of course, the value is the same for everything. That's not how this works. Um, we do want 40. Okay, well, uh, I'm going to go make one of the traps and see if they will accept more in exchange. I'll also take the bottles, because we only really need one, because I just want to try this gas thing out. So let's make... Uh, that leaves... Eh, let's try the bear trap, the, the real deal. It's got value 20, but do the three like it? So was that was that economical actually? Because it took... It's one to one. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay. I do want the rag. At least, and this is the better thing we can make too, so we should probably just straight up trade the scrap metal away. Um, I really only need one rag. I'm definitely way more interested in this thing. Okay, they take a little bit from the bottle. The bottle's not, you know, it's not not worth trading away. Ooh, I could also trade the torch away? I don't think I've ever... No, oh, get back in there. Actually used this trading interface this extensively before, because I've usually been pretty good about the resources, but I guess since it's been a while, I've, I've not been as efficient as I normally am. I'm not going to get another one of those. I do kind of want that, though. Yeah. Just because I'm going to burn one on the new torch, so... Oh, could I get a flint? Nope. Definitely can't get a flashlight. Oh, it's so tempting. So tempting. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna get more rags, just because we are going... Every time I drink one of these, I get another bottle. And I'm probably going to drink at least one of them, so... Let's craft... One of these. The one that doesn't take the more valuable resource. This one! Do I get a bottle out of this? Yeah, okay, cool. We're already in the green, as it were. Uh, I want to not... Can you, can you equip the other thing? Okay. And yeah, let's make you actually equip something useful. Alright, now I'm gonna go tuck away all the things that I care less about in here, like this thing, and... No, I wanna keep those. That. Yeah. Well, yeah, because I already have bandages. There's no point in keeping rags around, because all you can do is make bandages with them. And I don't really need the fast-acting bandages right now, because there's nothing really that dangerous around. So I'm going to go ahead and immediately make use of this thing. Because I don't ever want to be in the dark again. I'm just going to use up all of it. I feel like the gas can is going away less quickly than it used to. But I don't know. It could just be... Could just be a false impression. All right, so now we have about half. So that should last two days. That seems that seems brief. That seems really brief. Um, but yes. What am I doing here? I don't really know. I'm I'm gonna hold on to everything I have. Okay. All right. Well, uh, normally I would have here, but I do want to keep going because I want to go here. I think we're done with the barn house. I'm tempted to do another pass. And, ooh, we should visit the wolf as well. Just to meet him. I don't know if, it's, I don't know if that's useful, but it's nearby-ish to where we're going anyway. Alright, so first things first, let's, let's not be useful. Ooh! Need lockpick. Do I have any lockpicks? Have I found any lockpicking supplies? I don't think so. 
It's just straight. Just. Hey there, friend. Don't you worry. I don't intend to track with you. Here we go. It's raining again, too. That's weird. Alright, let's do this. I always hate this part, but we have to do it. Do we have to do it? I think we have to do it. I remember that we have to do it, so I'm doing it. Also, there's mushrooms and stuff. Alright, torch. Thick wooden stakes only barely hold the soaked ground along with the tangled up roots. The construction seems like it's about to collapse at any moment. I still don't know what that was. This is different. Okay, no, this is just oriented differently than I'm used to. They go away when you're not looking at them, which is interesting. Those used to be a way to upgrade yourself. Poisonous, poisonous, wait, poisonous mushroom service? Okay, sure. Those used to be a way to um, upgrade your health and stamina. You'd make these potions that would that would let you upgrade yourself, basically. They were pretty good. It, like, it was a good system. Um, I still don't know how I feel about the kind of fixed resource, you know, fixed health and stuff that we've got right now, but I think it works. It basically works. It's certainly a little bit less artificial. It's closed. This is my only way of getting out of this forest, but I won't be able to open it without my key. This looks like a just... Is it moving slightly? Yeah, it's just moving slightly. I'm not crazy. The handle is covered in a thick layer of dust. No one has opened for at least a fortnight. It looks like we were the last ones here. Press your ear against the key. Among the howling of the wind, I can hear a faint voice. It seems familiar and comes from inside the keyhole. Someone is calling my name. That's weird. Alright. Well, we've gotten some mushrooms and stuff. That wasn't good. Oh. Okay. Uh. That was tense. That was really tense. They changed it. There's an earthquake or something now? I don't know. Oh man, but that made me run. That made me run and then <laughs> waste resources for what I actually had to run. Holy crap. Oh, that was clever. I don't know if you even have to run there, but it certainly doesn't... Mm. You don't want to not run. I don't know how I feel about that kind of trick, though. Like, I will, I will, I will gladly, uh, praise it now, when, when it works, but given that one of the things about this game is the replayability aspect, it's procedurally generated, procedurally generated and everything, I don't know how I feel, like, that seems like it would only work the first time, right? next time I will know to not run, or I will try to at least, so there's got to be some reason to do that. Yes, me. Yes, indeed. He'll take it 16. Does he sell? I, th I think they all sell at about the same rate. I kind of want to get his thing, but I kind of want to save my reputation with him if I need other stuff for any reason. Like this chain. I think, I 
think he's the only place you can get one? I'm not sure. Um, I want to save my stone for the tr three, though. Alright, so visiting the Wolfman was kind of a bummer. Nothing to see here. I happen to know there's probably something for us up here, unless it's changed. Take wood logs and stones. Why not? Oh, birds. That means there's a corpse, which means there's loot. Which is a, if you think about it, really horrible way of thinking about things. But, welcome to Darkwood. Alright. Shrooms? Yes, please. All the delicious shrooms that I can stuff directly into my bloodstream. So that I can become better and see further, and get health, and standing in light. That really makes it sound like he's just getting high off his rocker, doesn't it? Ooh, more gas! Excellent! I do welcome gasoline. Of course, needs key. Don't have key. Okay. That's fine. Uh, we've still got probably a good bit of time, I think. So, where are we? We're up here. I'm gonna s just start heading south. Uh, I think we won't have much time to do anything once we get somewhere. But, we will at least... we'll probably run into something. Something worth. Uh, I don't like his theme. Not in a bad way. Like, it's... It, I mean that it, you know, makes me uneasy. Hi, Moose! Don't mind me. Just going south. Hey, a thing! Ooh! <laughs> oh. Oh. I was like, person? No! Of course not! It's dark wood. There are no other people who don't want to murder you. Do I want to go here? I think I'm just going to leave you alone. I could murder you. I don't, I don't feel like doing that. But now we have a location. Point of reference. Shrine. Yes. This broken tree looks so fun to see. All right, so we can take all these things. Stones, goodbye. Nothing for the gasoline. You, what are you more important? Than? Probably all the nails, or the matches, or some of those planks things. But you know what? I think none of those things. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this real quick. So I know that I've been here, but I was unable to pick up all the things. I don't remember if that has actually been successful at any point in time, but it makes me feel better, so I keep doing it. Oh, I like this, where this is the part you can't see over, that you can't see over this part. That's nice. It's a good touch. I appreciate it. Eh. I don't really need all the stones anymore. Well, maybe I do. I think those are a new item for this alpha. I have no idea where I am. I'm somewhere south of the broken tree. These seem a little bit more widely dispersed, which I think is cool. There were too many, like... And this is the wood repository of this biome. Kind of places. Which is just... I don't know. It's not great. Ooh, what did I leave? Rope. I definitely like rope. What do I like less than rope? Let me just make a lockpick. I don't think I can do anything else with it anyway right now. Oh! That works finally! Has that worked for a while? That's exciting! That is way too exciting. I don't really use the flares, let's be honest here. Maybe I should though. Maybe, maybe they will be useful to me in this playthrough. Um, yeah, it used, it used to be that it would not consider how much, like, it, when you went to craft something, it would just look at how much you had, and how many slots. Like, do you have a spare slot to th fit the thing you're about to craft? No? Then you can't craft it. That meant that when you were producing something that was going to, that was going to, uh, replace, like, those lockpicks, right? When I make it, it's just going to replace the thing. The, the lockpick slot, so it wouldn't do that sort of analysis, which meant that it would be 
very fr you, would, you would very like uselessly just sort of drop something, anything, because you have the slot. So you just drop it, make the thing, and pick it up again. And that wasn't. I didn't think that had any good purpose. That was just oversight. Like it doesn't it doesn't make the game more interesting to have that. Ooh, this is a, this is a place, right? Yeah, rocks. There's rocks over there too. But I think that's just dogs. And the ones that are just dogs have never really been. This sound cue needs to work at some point. Yeah, that's right. Your turn. Come here. Joy. Please. Shoo! I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to carry any of this shit. Um. Hmm. I can come back for this. And this. It's just wood. There's plenty of wood everywhere. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, wait. Alright. Anyway. No, 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 no. Bad dog. I remember when I used to be really afraid of the dogs. I don't really know why. I think I just wanted this game to be really, really scary. So I was like, well, ooh, a dog, ooh, brook. Ah, uh, yes. Has this changed at all? I wonder. I don't know if we have enough time to actually get into it, but we'll try. I'm certainly already full up on inventory. There's nothing back here. Is it over here? Oh, there it is. Yeah, the little pustule, pustule things. Are they here? Is this it? There's a there's a way to get inside is what I'm looking for. Yeah, here we go. This looks like afternoon. I think we're fine. There isn't a whole lot. There's a car. So this is another place that got just eaten by woods. I heard low frequency sounds. Hmm. Sure? No. There's a lamp and a wardrobe, which has... Oh man, so much gasoline! Ah, I'll take it. I will, I will definitely take it. Is that thing over there? Is it... Hmm. I don't know that I've ever tried to put gas... Uh, really? I don't remember this being this hard. Oh, is it because of the, because of the thing I dropped? Probably is. Is this gonna work? This might work. Yeah! So yeah, I think... If I remember this... Yeah. There's a corpse. And... Suddenly not. There's a weird, creepy, flickery light. I don't know what happens if you... Can you spend the night here? How would you spend the night here? I guess you'd just get behind that wardrobe and turn on the lights and then wait. Actually, with, with, when you turn on the light, is there any... Yeah, I don't know how you would do that. Because you no longer need... The, oh, you need the gas. Oh, right. No, that definitely. It definitely would work. I'm gonna. I'm about to run out of my only weapon. This has been a long day. I feel like, like we've done a lot. I have. I have given up on a lot of items, and we're not even done with the meadow. Although I feel well. It seems to me like it's smaller than it usually was. I'm not sure. I, I don't ever really recall having the sense that I'm having now of I've basically gone over all the major features. Oh man, this is good. I'll come back to you. I, you're now on my map. You're definitely going to come back to you. And now it's getting to be sundown, so... I'm going to probably empty some of these uh, um, gas cans into our, our stuff. 
Is this it? Is this it right here? This is this is this is home, right? No. Okay. So what's what is this? This is just no man's land. Weird. There's nothing here except for oh, there we go. I found something. Great. It's weird rituals being performed by the, the locals. Fantastic. Does that show up? Is that a place? Yeah, it is. Okay. That's good. That's fine. Alrighty then. So... I thought I heard mushroom noises, but apparently I did not hear any such thing. Alright. So first things first. I am just gonna fill up the shit out of this thing. Well, actually... Does that make sense to do? Well, I'm gonna go upgrade first, because that, that makes sense to do, because I, I have time limits on that. What? Oh. Oh, cool. Excellent. So this, uh, I think it's the next one that gives us a fever dream. Mushroom healing. This is kind of the most useful one, I think. Just because it means that we can, uh, after a particularly bad night event, or just during the day, we could heal up, uh, heal up, basically. So, whereas this, eh, I don't have that much trouble getting around, and eating mushrooms just seems like a waste of mushrooms. So, alright, there we go. Cool. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Press Q. Oh, there's a prompt for this now. I either missed that the first time, or it just wasn't there. So, the first time I grabbed all the skills. I think that one's recorded, too, where I was just like, I don't, I have no idea what the hell to do with this. Uh, I'm gonna hold on to my gas cans, you know what, because I think what, what's left to do here, we can explore and gather some items and regather some items, but by and large, the next objective, I think we're, you know, we're generally done with the meadow. Our next step would be to go fulfill the Wolfman's quest. Which, if I remember correctly, there is like a... Where is it? Journal? J? Yeah, we have a, a thing that's supposed to help us with, with this. I'm going to read these in case they've changed. <laughs> All these stupid savages. Everything should go according to plan. That's... that's this is cool. Because this is just a little... A little snippet of... Um, who this guy is and what his relationship is with the locals. That's that's neat. I like this. I don't remember anything from the attack on our camp. Somehow I'm wearing a coat which I've never seen before. Must have changed my clothes along the way. I don't recognize myself anymore. I can barely hold this pencil. My body is changing. I no longer feel hunger or thirst. Oh, that's good. I did, did this always mention this? I don't think this mentioned this. So now we know. Like we have sort of that <laughs> a lower excuse. For why is it that he drinks mushrooms and doesn't eat anything? Something happened. Okay, that's neat. I remember his face. The man who saved, then tortured me. But I don't remember how I escaped and ended up here. The fucker took my key, my only chance of getting out of here. He took a part of my journal. I doubt he will be able to find the underground passage with it. I should check it, just to be sure. See if the door is closed. I don't think he will still be at the place where he held me. It makes no difference, as I have no idea how to get back there. Day one, the night. I need to remember to get the hideout before dusk. Only the protective gas can give me relative safety from the woods at night. Hmm. Day two, wolf. My mind must be going. I met a person with the head of a wolf. He promised to help me get back my key if I find him in, in his camp in the eastern part of the silent forest. Before I go there, I should explore the dry meadow. Wolf camp. Wolf's first camp is in the northeastern part of the dry meadow. Day 3. Underground passage. The armored door is locked. Good news. The thief who stole my key apparently does not know where this door is. Bad news. I don't know where the thief is. Right. So apparently... Hmm. I like this backstory. I really... I'm excited to see it develop. Because... So his camp was attacked and something changed him. But we don't know what or why. <laughs> But yes, I think we're basically going to be going to the forest next time. Um, we can make another one of these. Let's do that. Always want more inventory space. And I think I'm going to need one of these, so I'm just going to go ahead and prepare. I have a lot of these now, so that's good. Right. Uh, well, I want to carry.
carry just like ten or something. I don't know. Not not that not that many of them. Ditto with the matches. I want like five matches, six matches, whatever. This is fine. This I want to trade. Oh wait, wait. I need I need light. Damn it! What am I doing? Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Where am I? I don't know where I am. Shit. Ugh. This is what I get for not paying attention. This this is why. This tells me that I should make sure that I stop now because it's only gonna get harder in the next area. I don't have anything that I need to cook, do I? No. Okay, at least I took care of that. Alrighty. Hmm? Someone outside? I should stash this and carry around the worst one. Did this thing pop? Oh, shit. Cool. Well. That went fine. Why haven't I been attacked by shadows here? That's my question. I kinda wanna board all this up. I also want more wood, but I guess I have a bunch of planks and a bunch of logs and that's kind of what that's for. Uh oh. Oh no. What? Please tell me no. Oh shit. Why? No. It's safer out here. <laughs> this could go very wrong very quickly. This would also n totally not be a solution in some of the later areas. <sighs> what are you supposed to do against these things? Poltergeist? it's still here okay well at least it's almost daytime Do. 
I didn't know they came after you like that either. I mean, I, I guess I did. They, they've always done that to me, to some degree. Like they never just, they never just stay there. Although they seemed to ignore me, more or less, once I wasn't in here. Once I started, like, opening the door and stuff. I mean, maybe it was just, maybe it was just heading outside? I don't know. I also think, if you just don't look at it, does that work? I think it just gets close to you and does its thing, then. Okay, so it does take about two pips per night. So I'm just gonna burn this guy on this, because, mm -mm. well, because I think that's a fair amount of, in case I come back here, I don't want it to screw me over. That's also true. I'll leave that open. I'm, I'm thinking about the Banshee, and if I board that up, there's not really anywhere for it to come in from except here. Can they break down? Actually, maybe that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. If you could barricade, I think you could barricade it in, essentially. Like, we could close this door and then very quickly barricade it in, and then it's not a problem. But I think that's our only option. Because all the other times, like, as, as I've seen before, they do seem to kind of come for you. So, I don't know. We'll see. But that means we have to keep three planks on us at all times, which is a little bit high. That's probably more worth of, out of it than I could, could get normally. So. I'm scared to give them the weird stone. Hold on, let me, let me go at least make sure isn't any reason to... I'm sure we'll find more weird stones, too. That's always the thing. Like, watch out for being too stingy in games like this, because you'll just actually end up screwing yourself if you don't just behave normally. Alright, so I am gonna sell that, because I don't really have a use for it right now. Okay. I do... The wood sounds real nice, but so, did, so does mushroom. But at this point, well, I don't know. I have I have plenty of ways to, to get wood. No, wait. I do want I do want to do that. We'll get back to you though. Um. All right. And there's also one thing to keep in mind is that any reputation we use for night mushrooms here is going to be wasted relative to night mushrooms off in the forest. So, that goes there, that goes there, that all, I don't, I never have to manually use those, so. <sighs> Two max. what do I need? Wood, I kind of want to upgrade the workshop. Maybe I should, maybe I should, yeah, I'm just, I'm going to do that. Oh, no, no, wait, hold on. Uh, I'm being dumb, I think, I keep thinking I have to trade with them, but I don't. I'm just going to go. 15. 15 fuel makes a log, and I have what, 10.5? Does this make it 12? So this is 1.5 each. Click. 13. Each click is 1. So this is 15. Does that work out to the same thing if you just do Seventeen. Yeah, you know what? It's just... Yep. Planks. Because I now want to make sure that I have... I don't know, some amount here to... Yes! Upgrade! Cool! Moving it forward, we can make guns next on the next upgrade, which takes stuff. We need six. Hold on, let me just set aside stuff. Ten of these. Ten of these. Six of these and a toolbox. It will have it upgraded. So that's our little savings pool. 
Uh, we want to keep around some nails and some planks so that we can do what we need to do in an emergency, like last night when we didn't do it because we're done. Alright. Lockpick. Lockpick is actually lower. Like I'm never, never going to touch it. It's just always going to be auto-used. Okay. We can make cocktails and uh, molotovs now, too, so that's exciting. I don't know, that's not helpful against banshees, is it? I feel like I should repair this at some point, but I also feel... I keep having these ideas about how to fortify this base and stuff, but in practice, we're probably going to immediately take off, so it doesn't really make sense to do that. How much rep do we have with you? Mm, you know enough that I feel like it's not a waste to stock up on a few extra planks with you. Gas? We've actually got quite a bit of gas. I'm pretty satisfied with our gas reserves right now. Probably. Seven planks is a bit high, but I wanted to make sure... Like, I don't want it to be the case that I can only fortify once. I think five. Because you get, you get some back. You get some back when you... When you, uh... We need them. Probably, like, ten find out, actually. Let's just, let's just find out. How much of these should we be carrying? Yeah, we have, like, we have a good amount of gas to last us the night and stuff. I'm not really hurting on gas right now. But, okay, so barricading takes three and seven. Oh, wow. That's more than I expected. So, I'm just, yeah, I'm just gonna carry around the 2015 or something. 15, I think, would be the better number. So much inventory management. I never really remember that until I actually get around to playing playing item Tetris. Alright, well that's the barricade. And new one takes five and nine. Do we want to do that? Not really. In the worst case I'd like barricade this. Actually we can yeah, and in case of Banshee we can also corral ourselves in. Not just corral it in, but corralling it in is nice because it means you don't have to, uh, um, sacrifice something on your, your end for it, essentially. I don't think I really need that, so, okay, anyway, it's time to start thinking in terms of getting out of here, essentially. So I am going to... Mm, let me think. Because this matters. Because there's a little gate thing here. And we want to go all the way over there. And there's a hideout that we would want to clean up. But we might not have enough time to do all of that in one day. So I think for now, I'm going to err on the safe side and not carry... Not tr but basically try and move the hideout stuff with me. Like, oh right, I don't, I don't have to do that either. It's right, I don't have to do that because there's the bike man. And whenever I, when I, when I get to hideout two, I will, I will get him to bring my stuff in exchange for beer. Right, I don't have to do this anymore. I, I forget that. That used to be. That was not... Mm, that was another thing that I was glad they kind of fixed. There's a there's a good sort of... It's very grounded to have to do that, but it's just not really that much fun or scary or anything. It's just like, well, I'm going to spend... It's not even that costly, really. Like, I never did it because I was stubborn, but if you think about it, you just be like, well, okay, so th the next day, the first half of the next day, I'm going to just go fetch all my stuff. And, or, you know, the stuff that matters, and then I'm just going to, you know, bring it here, and then I'll just proceed on my merry way, and be a half day... Th the game would just be a half day longer. Like, there's no tension there, it just lengthens the experience. There's not... or, you know, I could come back several times, pick it up, so... Yeah, I, I'm glad that that change was made, and it's also kooky, and it fits Darkwood so well. Alright, so for tomorrow, I think... Hmm, 
I'm gonna go to the broken tractor, finish that up, because there's some stuff there that I want to make sure I pick up. Um, and then I think we're gonna start making our way to the silent forest. Maybe not the Wolfman camp. Probably wanna secure the hideout first. Um, but we're definitely gonna at least make it through this, this little gateway by by next episode, I think. So Anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up here for today, because we have a clear goal, and I think we did all the things that I sort of wanted to do uh, for now. So uh, let's end it here, and I will catch you next time when we explore the Silent Forest. As always, thank you for watching.